a donkey and a mule. Okay. Cody Stark saddling up and learning how to ride. Hey, buddy. Well, uh huh? That was yes, so dramatic. Indeed. There is a difference between a donkey and a mule and a well, there's not really much of a difference between a donkey and a burrow. Uh, this is Jody Collins. Jody, you were one of the premier donkey experts all of North America. Is that true? Okay. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> She's known worldwide for masters of donkeys. Okay, so could you explain the difference between donkeys and mules? Pretend like I don't know. Like, I don't know the difference between a donkey and a mule. So what's the difference between a donkey and a mule? The difference is a, a donkey is a species created in nature naturally. The mule is a combination of the horse bred to a donkey. Uh -huh. Which is uh -huh. The more you know. If we only had some examples to kind of show. So this guy right here, that's this, a donkey. This is a donkey. Um, this would be what we call the large standard size measurement of the donkey. This is what people typically think of as a donkey when they hear donkey burrow. This is like what they think. Okay, okay. Um, this is also a donkey. Even though it's got the, the crazy coloration Even on it? with the color. Mm -hmm. um, as you can see, a much larger animal. Um, something people don't assume happens is that the donkeys can be very large animals. Uh -huh. um, Including like that one. as large as a big horse. Yeah, that one. Um, that one's huge. Yes, and these are your mammoths. They call them mammoth donkeys. It's all based on, on, uh, size measurement anymore. In the beginning of American history with our donkeys, there were some very specific mammoth pedigrees. We've kind of mucked them up a little bit, where well. it's not so true anymore. Um, um, now it just gets down to our measurements. Anything under 14 hands will be our standards over 14 hands. Okay, will be so mammoth. these guys are donkeys, and that would be a mule over there then, right? This is a mule. This is a colorful mule because she was bred to a colored mare called the Appaloosa. So we, we got the color from the horse, which would not ever happen in a donkey. And, and the features changed because of the combination with the horse as one of the parents, the mom. So if you notice, the, the face is very uh, typey, we call it. Mm -hmm. um, just a cleaner, less bone, nice horse look to okay. it. Um, unlike the donkeys, who tend to be just a little bit uh, bonier in their brow. Oh, um, I see. Um, just a heavier see. boned animal, a okay. larger ear. And then what's the difference between a donkey and a burrow then? The difference of the donkey and the burrow is nothing. <laughs> it's the same thing. It's the same thing. You guys at the station have been really good. So since you've been so good, okay. we're going to show you a donkey. Oh. I'm telling you, it's the cutest thing you've ever seen in your whole entire life. Okay, it, but you're breaking up. It's so worth it. There he is right there. And Jody, what did we name him? This morning, we officially christened him Cody. Cody. Yay! It's Cody the baby donkey. Right there. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. Okay, I'm gonna ride I'm gonna ride a donkey coming up. Not Cody the donkey, but a different right. donkey coming up. Back to you guys. Okay, I can't wait he, to see you that. You have already fallen once a day. And then you twerked. 